everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm sending you a virtual hug. As you can see, my makeup today is super natural, super basic, it's suitable to any daytime activity like go to school, go to work, or meet up with your customer. Of course, you're gonna impress them a lot. My makeup today is very dramatic and sexy. The end of the year is here, so there's plenty of evening or night parties that you need to attend. And I think this makeup will definitely help you to stand out from the crowd. I throw on some big lashes and then some glitter, some cherry, dark cherry eyeshadow with like super dark cherry lips. And of course, people are gonna notice you. That's what we all want, right? So yeah, if you're interested in how to create this look, keep on watching. So first up, I'm gonna moisturize my skin, get it ready for the makeup. And then now applying the foundation everywhere. Then using this beauty blender just to blend it really really well into my skin. Not gonna forget the eyelids and then the neck and also my ear. Just make sure that I blend it really really well because I don't want the color between my face and my neck is different. It's gonna look super weird. And now I'm gonna cover those under eye circles with the concealers and I also put some on top of my nose and then some on my chin as well and I also put some extra concealers slash highlighter just to brighten up the areas now again with the beauty blender just dapping and blend everything into my skin so far I found this is the best technique to create a flawless, smooth and beautiful finish now I'm gonna pick up my face using the Chanel Loose Powder to give everything a lock-in because of course, we expect our makeup to last all night long and I also set the foundation and concealers on my eyelid as well Contouring and bronzing time I just want to create an illusion that I have super high cheekbones Just slightly dust it on your forehead your jawline just to add some color to my face then going all over with face powder now I'm adding some peach blush now I'm building these pinkest red shadows in the outer corners of the eyes slowly and gradually then just slowly drag it up like you're drawing eyeliner and blend it really well in the burnt orange color make a fading effect using the same red color in the corners of the eyelid we're gonna make the hollow eyes today now using the same brush just go over the grease a few times now just use a clean brush to blend everything together using my finger just pop some white shimmers in the center of my eyelid glitter primer is a must if you want your glitter to stay in play and don't rush when you apply glitter because you don't want to fall out and the glitter gonna be all over the places Now just added the same red color to the lower lash line and also the burnt orange color to fade it out and make it more natural. Next step, I'm gonna curl my lashes and add some mascara. And for this look, a thick dramatic pair of fake eyelashes will bring everything together. Here just added some shimmery to make the eyes more awake And I'm also gonna show the light here to make the look more dramatic and sexy And the eyes more mysterious Are we done yet? No, we are not Now I'm gonna continue to line my eyes And make it more dark and more defined And also cat eyed We cannot go wrong with a cat eyed just really be patient with it and slowly build it to where you wanted it to be. I also use the cream liner to line my water lines as well. Then I don't have a lot of lower lashes, so I'm using a pen liner to draw a few and using a mascara to apply it and thicken them. 
Here, I got my eyebrow tattoo long, long time ago. Um, the tattoo is gone, but the shape is still very visible. So now I'm using an eyebrow pencil just to fill it in and got it to the way I wanted it to look like. And then with the brush, just to blend everything in. And also not to forget the eyebrow gel to keep it in place. And I do prefer my eyebrow a bit more defined, so I'm gonna just use it. A concealer that we used earlier just to clean it up a little bit and make it more sharp. Just blend it out. And apply some white color shadow just to set it in place. And again just blend everything all together to avoid harsh line. Now I'm gonna just contouring my nose make me look like I just got my nose done but I'm actually not okay we're almost done I'm gonna just highlight my cheekbones my cupid bone my nose bridge finally she's gonna add some lip balm and then some super matte liquid lipstick this one is my favorite I love it I love the color on me it's beautiful and it's definitely created a statement. And that's it. Thank you for watching.